so we have 68 minus 6. So because we're subtracting, let's write the number 68 at the end of our number line. So we have 6 tens and 8 units. Take away 1, and we have 67. Take away 2 from 68, and we have 66. Take away 3, and we have 65. Take away 4, and we have 64. Take away 5, and we have 63. And now take away 6, and we have 62. So now we've subtracted 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 from 68 to give us 62. Now 43 minus 5, so on our number line, we start at 43 at the end, 4 tens and 3 units. Now pause the video and see if you can count back 5 to get your answer. So take away 1 gives us 42. Take away 2 from 43, we have 41. Take away 3 and we have 40. Now we're going to need to break up our tens into units so we can continue to subtract. So take away 4, and we have 39, and take away 5, and we have 38. So we started on 43, we counted back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and we got the answer 38. Now we have 66 take away 7. So we start on 66, which is 6 tens and 6 units. Now pause the video and see if you can answer 66 take away 7. So subtract 1, and we have 65. Subtract 2 from 66, and we have 64. Subtract 3, and we have 63. Subtract 4, and we have 62. Subtract 5, we have 61. Subtract 6, and we have 60. And now let's break up our tens into units, and we've subtracted 6. So if we subtract one more, we have 59. So we started on 66, we counted back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and we got our answer 59.